Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel, My Project Ideas. In this video, we'll be discussing a C++ based credit card validator system, which is built in C++ programming language, which identifies that whether the credit card number is valid or invalid. And according to Lewin's algorithm, it will uh, recognize the type of card and uh, whether the credit card number is valid or not. As far as building this requirements is, as far as of, uh, requirements of this model, uh, model building is concerned, we require a C++ programming language and a Visual Studio Code or any other code editor. I have specifically mentioned Visual Studio Code out here because I have uh, used uh, Visual Studio Code. You can use any other ID on which C++ can be installed and run. So with that being said, let's get started and let's have a look on the code that this is basically an entire C++ code uh, to generate a system which checks whether the credit card number is valid or not. Basically, initially we have declared all the uh, necessary variables that is credit, credit number, PCC, sum, count, etc. And this particular algorithm is Lewin's algorithm. This is basically, there is no, no as such logic out here in this algorithm. This is a by default set algorithm that is Lewin's algorithm, which uh, generates a identification number and checks that particular number according to some different conditions. And if that conditions get matched, then the credit card number is said to be as valid. And if it is not matched, it is uh, displayed as invalid. And it even uh, tells us the card, a credit card, credit card type, type of the credit card. That is, it is American Express, MasterCard or Gateway. So basically, this is entirely a Lewin's algorithm. First step is to uh, the check whether the account number entered is greater than zero or not. Then this particular algorithm is the first phase of Lewin's algorithm. Then second condition is this particular logic will divide and uh, calculate the remainder by dividing by 10. And we will also uh, tell the quotient divided by 10 by the by this particular system. So this particular system is basically designed to check whether the uh, credit card number is valid or not, which ultimately decreases the rate of cybercrime and bank fraudulent transactions that are uh, uh, carried out through uh, invalid credentials of the credit card. So basically this particular credit card system in C++ helps us to uh, check whether the credit card number is valid or not. If it is valid, it is uh, printed as valid and the card type. If it is not valid, then it is uh, printed as uh, not valid and the program exits. So this is basically in condition that if first digit equal to equal to four and count of one equal to equal to 13 and count of one equal to equal to 16, this is valid. Else if these are the invalid conditions and accordingly we'll print the type of the credit card. So we have printed, uh, so this is basically an entire C++ code to check whether the uh, credit card number is valid or not. If it is valid, then we'll go for Lewin's algorithm and that through that Lewin's algorithm, we'll uh, identify that particular number. And if it is not valid, it will print as not valid. So let's have a look on the output of this particular code by hitting the run button out here. This is basically an entire C++ code. You can have a look. I'll scroll down uh, gradually so that you can understand each and every logic of Lewin's algorithm uh, precisely. So we have declared all that this is basically an else if else ladder where all the conditions are checked out here. And this is basically a for loop. We have uh, generated a for loop. So this is basically an entire C++ code to check whether the credit card uh, is valid or not. So as I run, as I hit the run button, so it is asking that uh, enter the credit card number. Uh, so it is, let's enter it as somewhat like this. It is invalid. So as I have entered some invalid credit card number, so it's invalid. Let's enter another number. Again, it is invalid. So basically this is entire, you can, you can uh, see that this particular code is, uh, uh, inv uh, invalid. So the credit card cannot be considered as a uh, permanent, uh, flow of, uh, this cannot be used in the, uh, permanent flow of transactions. So basically this is an invalid credit card number. Uh, the next we would see, uh, 
uh, we'll uh, type some uh, valid credentials. Let let's type some valid credentials. Uh, what is the condition for valid conditions? That if first two equal to equal to thirty four, if first digit equal to equal to four, and count of one. Count of one is. Uh, you can see that count of one equal to equal to zero, and count of one is equal to equal to thirteen. And count of or is is sixteen. So valid. So I will write it as. Uh, oh, it's I need terminal. I need to run this particular code through terminal now. So the program to run C plus plus code is G plus plus the file name dot cpp, credit dot cpp. Uh, the code is compiling. Yes, it is compiled. A tab. Enter the credit card number. So I will write as four one three seven eight nine six seven four three. It is again invalid. So basically, we are we are yeah, we are entering all the invalid numbers. You can check these uh, check but this particular program for valid credentials. It will show accordingly that uh, this is a this is a valid uh, condition and the type of the credit card is uh, American Express, Mastercard or or other card type. Uh, so I I hope the things are precise and clear enough. The code is understandable enough. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much, guys, for, for watching this video. I hope the things are precise and clear enough. For more interesting stuffs in technical domain, please do subscribe to our channel, My Project Ideas. Thank you so much, guys.